Welcome back everyone. So we have almost completed one side of this round. Instead of just three double crochets we have now seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We are in the corner now where we're increasing so we're going to chain two. The light is very bright. I hope that doesn't blind you or anything. And we're going to work another shell of two double crochets in the same chain two space. So one and two. And just like on the other side, we're working three double crochets on top of each stitch. So what are those three stitches? We are ignoring the chain two. Those are so one, two and three. So we're going to insert our hook below those two loops and working one double crochet. And then again in the next one. So two. My yarn got stuck between the tripod's legs. That was two. And the third one. We are at the corner and that's where we are working the two shells of two double crochets each separated by a chain two. So one, two, chain two, we are increasing the corners. making the solid granny square larger and another shell right there so two I'm getting a lot of puff <sighs> what we do now I hope you already know the answer you're working three double crochets on top of the stitches. So that's one, two right there. And three. So that's the chain. We have another corner and what we do in the corners we work two sets of double crochet each separated by a chain two. That was the chain and working the second set of double crochet in the same chain two space. one and one double crochet in there just let me unravel some more yarn okay starting back again These are the last three stitches. We're working our double crochets on top of them. So that's the first chain. Second, right there. And the 
third one. We are at the last corner where we already have a set of two. This is the chain three we worked, the first double crochet we worked between the space. So what we have to do is work work another two double crochets exactly like the other corners. So in that space we are working one and a second double crochet. We are chaining one and then we are joining with this stitch in the third one from the beginning. So as you can see this is one, two and the third chain. So we are inserting our hook below below the loops on top of the stitch just like that pull the yarn through keep the loops on, on the stitch and work a single and we have completed second round of the solid granny square. Again we are chaining three to step up to the third round. So that was three. This is the corner. This is the other corner. The other one and the fourth. We are working, remember, we are working two sets of two double crochets in these corners and we chain two to increase the size of uh, the granny square. So we are working our first set of double crochets, we've already chained three and we're working another double crochet right there and what we have to do now is work Uh, double crochets in on top of each of these stitches. So how many are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are always seven. So working a double crochet in the first one. That's it. This is usually a bit tighter because this is the chain three. We're working at the beginning. So that's one. Two. One minute left for me, guys. I'm going to make this side. And I'm going to see you guys in the next uh, in the next one. Three, four, five, six, and seven. Working two double crochets in the chain space. And chaining two. And see you in a couple of seconds. <laughs> 